Temporal infraction. Developing a physical theory around the idea of temporal infraction, where the day still has 24 hours, but the value of these hours decreases, involves a series of assumptions and extrapolations that mix theoretical physics, philosophical concepts, and the subjective perception of time. Let's explore this idea in a structured manner. 1. Definition of temporal infraction. Temporal infraction would be a condition or phenomenon in which, despite the objective measure of time remaining constant, i.e., a day still has 24 hours, the quality or value of this time is perceived as diminished. This reduction in the value of time could be quantified in terms of efficiency, subjective perception, or capacity for achievement within a time period. 2. Initial Hypotheses Temporal Dilution Hypothesis Propose that there is a dilution of temporal experience, where each unit of time, hour, minute, becomes less dense in terms of quality or utility, similar to the concept of entropy in thermodynamics, where the system tends towards a state of greater disorder. Subjective Compression Hypothesis suggests that there is a compression in the subjective perception of time, where the human brain processes time in an accelerated manner, making it seem like less time is available. 3. Mathematical Model We could model time not just as a linear dimension, but as a function that depends on psychological, social, and even cosmological variables. If T24 represents the 24 hours of a day, we could introduce a temporal infraction factor I, T, that modifies the perception or value of these hours. T24 foot equals T24 times I, T, where I, T, is a decreasing function of time, T, representing the decrease in the perceived value of time as days pass. 4. Physical Interpretation we can hypothesize that this temporal infraction is caused by external or internal interference, external causes, a cosmological phenomenon that affects temporal perception, such as a variation in the expansion rate of the universe, which could influence how matter, including human brains, interacts with time. Internal causes, a neurological or psychological change that, over time, alters how human beings process the passage of time, similar to how gravity can bend space-time in general relativity. 5. Experiments and Predictions To test this theory, we could measure the subjective perception of time in different populations over time, observing if there's a tendency for people to feel they have less time as they age or in different seasons of the year. Investigate if there's a correlation between cosmic or geophysical events and changes in temporal perception. Develop computational models that simulate how time perception can be affected by psychological and physical factors, adjusting the I, T, factor to predict different scenarios of temporal infraction. 6. Conclusions and Implications If this theory proved true, it could have profound implications for how we understand time, both in a physical and subjective sense. It could also influence how we organize our lives, from structuring work time to valuing leisure time. This temporal infraction theory is an attempt to combine physical concepts with human perception of time, exploring new ways to understand how we experience and value time in our daily lives. Although still purely speculative, it offers an interesting field for future theoretical and experimental explorations.